Preparation of Selective and Differential Medium A culture medium is a solid or liquid preparation used to grow, transport and store microorganisms. To be effective, the medium must contain all the nutrients the microorganisms require for growth. Specialized media are essential in the isolation and identification of microorganisms, the testing of antibiotic sensitivities, water and food analysis, industrial microbiology and other activities. In addition to nutrients necessary for growth of all bacteria, special purpose media contain one or more chemical compounds that are essential for their functional specificity. These include selective media, differential media and enriched media. Selective media allow certain types of organisms to grow and inhibit the growth of other organisms. Selective inhibition of some types of microorganisms can be achieved by adding dyes, antibiotics, salts or specific inhibitors which affect the metabolism or enzyme systems of the organisms. Examples are eosine methylene blue agar, mannitol salt agar, ectone enteric agar, phenyl ethyl alcohol agar. Differential media are used to differentiate closely related organisms or groups of organisms. Example, Makongi agar, eosine methylene blue agar. Materials required Bacterial cultures Inoculating loop Differential and selective medias which include Mannitol salt agar Makongi agar Eosine methylene blue agar Hectone enteric agar Procedure Arrange all the cultures and media in the lamina airflow Flame the inoculating loop and transfer a loop full of culture from the tube labelled Escherichia coli onto an EMP plate and perform a continuous streak. Similarly, to a second plate of EMB, transfer a loop full of culture of Enterobacter aerogenes by continuous streaking. Similar procedure was repeated in all selective and differential media for differentiating their growth characteristics of the organisms used. All the plates were incubated aerobically at 37 degrees Celsius for 24 hours. Results Mannitol salt agar is used for the isolation of pathogenic Staphylococci from mixed cultures. Staphylococcus auris was grown in one plate of MSA and into a second plate Staphylococcus epidermidis was grown. Staphylococcus auris ferments mannitol thereby changing the color of the medium from red to yellow. Staphylococcus epidermidis produce colonies with the red or purple zones without mannitol fermentation. Eosine methylene blue agar is both a selective and differential medium used for the detection and isolation of gram-negative intestinal pathogens. In eosine methylene blue agar, Escherichia coli produce dark blue-black colonies with a metallic green sheen indicating vigorous fermentation of lactose and acid production. Enterobacter aerogenes produce blue dark centered mucoid colonies indicating lactose fermentation and acid production. Makongi agar is selective for gram negative bacteria and can differentiate those bacteria that are able to ferment lactose. Escherichia coli are lactose fermenters and thereby appear pink, while Pseudomonas aerogenosa are non lactose fermenters and appear colorless or golden colored. Hectonentric agar is a moderatively selective medium used for the isolation and cultivation of gram-negative enteric microorganisms, especially Shigella and Salmonella from a variety of clinical and non-clinical specimens. On HEA agar, Shigella species developed into green-colored colonies with darker blue-green centers. Salmonella species appear as blue-green colonies with or without black centers.